Hello and welcome back to some more of Dwarf Fortress. We are in the Fireclaw Fort and we are trying, trying, trying to get all the infrastructure set up for the glory of the fortress. This is a crappy position for an F1 that's not really even the entrance. I'm gonna put the F1 on this because this is really the gate, the real gate as it were. So, bridge. Raises like that. And where are my gold bars? There they are. So, gold. Now I could put some here. If I put a bridge like this, would it block the entrance? That's a curious thought, isn't it? So it would raise like this. And Oh, that's a very stupid idea. That's a very stupid idea trying to make it out of gold, because this needs to be magma safe. Doesn't it? We are going to make it out of iron. Because we should have some iron. I mean, we don't have Fluxstone anyway, and unless we import that, making steel is a practical impossibility. As in, not worth the trouble. So we might as well use that for something else, like magma safe stuff. Also... I use dacite mechanisms and use copper spears. I have a feeling we should have more copper spears, but since the weapons are being kept in the bins and the bins keep getting moved around, well, they don't always get properly registered, do they? But, you know, we're gonna start making more traps here. Because that is what a sane person would do. Isn't it? Isn't it? Uh, we're gonna kill this and we're gonna make an iron door, actually. Furniture, iron and iron door. Please make it now. Because... Well, yeah, we're gonna make a thing. Of course, if there's backwash of magma here, we're kind of boned anyway. So we need to ensure that there is no backwash. There needs to be an upstair here. Which needs to go up down here. Up to here, up to here, okay, let's say up to here, not up to here. So here it would be a downstair, okay, it would go, well this could just be the spigot, right? for dumping the magma out. And up here. Up down, up down. No, that's bad. That would come up into our bone stockpile. Here. 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 And this would be a normal thing. Yay, so. Ok, 
Okay. And here... Well now... We can make this into a automatic pump system. More or less. So... Essentially coming down from above here... In like this. And we'll make a essentially iron floodgate for there. Furniture, iron. Iron floodgate. Here. Yeah, I did make a ramp here, but... So what? That's probably unnecessary. I'm gonna hope that the magma can just be... Well... Hopefully it's not gonna go... I mean, it doesn't need to be a big opening, does it, in order to be powerful. We're gonna co hook up the... the uh, thing with the appropriate gear assembly out to here and we can make some windmills here in order to power the whole thing so we'll have a separate system for turning on the pump and for actually enabling the flow. And that being the case, we're going to want a reservoir to ensure that the magma is pushing out with appropriate pressure. So, yeah, it's going to get fun. This is going to be interesting. Let's see what happens. This is going to be glorious. I might put a iron door here for uh, safety, just in case of backwash or something. I'll put the floodgate here. Floodgate is X here. There, we'll put it there. And you are happily digging. Good for you, buddy. You keep at it. Sir, here's the list. Looks like we're out of these things here, you see? Oh, yes. We need to build some of these. Great. Needs valid active ac uh, sand action zone. Well, this is it then. Jim Q. No, under mandates. Bins. Well, at least it's sensible what they're doing. Green glass. Make me 200 units of it, please. Then we're gonna cut it to pieces. <laughs> Well, we could make this level the reservoir, then it wouldn't force the magma up, would it? And we could actually... Well, it wouldn't make much difference, would it? In this case, would it? Would it, would it, would it? It really wouldn't, would it? Would it now? This can be dug. 
Surely that will be fine. If we dig it a bit. And some doors, please. Okay, here we can just put down a glorious iron door. Yet, actually, forget about smoothing this part, it's fine. And everyone is happily busy doing other things. Okay, they're putting all the clothing in the bins. Hello. That's actually mildly useful. Well done. Okay, so this is gonna be our bone stockpile now. The new one. Ah. And make more bone crossbows. I want to see all of the bone crossbows. Gonna remove this. This should be a sufficiently big reservoir to make things really nasty for anyone that tries coming through the front gate. Uninvited. Hmm, yeah, this should work. Should. Um, I should make a shield thing to ensure the magma does not spread essentially to the... To the uh, millstone, like so. This should ensure that it gets deflected around. Should. Yeah, should. So, we're gonna need some things, like a green glass Corkscrew and tube. Norm's corkscrew and we're gonna need a block. Here. I should have dudes on glass working, if I recall, because I put some of them on it. And we can probably put the soap making down with the kitchens. Uh, we would need an ashery and we would need a soap makers for soap. Which is reasonable, I think. Oh look, they've dyed some thread. Oh, that's... It's like he's actually doing something. It's like he's trying to be useful. And Kias are stealing my stuff again. What else is new? What is it with the lag? Oh look, we found gems. Ha! Ah. Okay, this is where we're gonna put the machines. Okay. This will need to be removed, but this will need to be dug out and gloriousness will be had. Let us construct it. Okay, you're making it. He's actually making it. Oh, so good. So good. And this is going to be just like a huge magma thing. Just like sploosh. Gonna be glorious. Um, okay. So, we're gonna need some levers from magma. Safe stuff. But that's for just the actual connections. So, these can be made out of granite. Like, I know basalt is safe. I'm pretty sure that side is not. So I'm going to save the basalt ones for this. Also, just like gold door there, randomly, thank you. Uh, 
What if I build up like this and had it like so? No, that would still not work. What if I had it like so and had it here? And just had the another random office there. Or actually like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That, well, that actually kind of works. For the captain of the guard, I mean. Gold table. Gold throne. Gold cabinet, of course. Gold chest, of course. Gold armor stand, of course. Gold weapon rack, of course. There. That should be mildly helpful. It looks like this is a popular uh, pathway. People seem to be traveling through it a lot. So, machines, you say? Uh, use the crappy mechanisms, of course. The ones we can afford to waste. There we go. Uh, change direction. And yeah, let's just set up the machine. No. Um, shit. Brain. Damn it, brain. Needs more horizontal axles. There, like that. That's how we set it up. Okay. Channel out this style. Someone. Why are you going up? Oh, right, you're using a gem bin to grab the things. That's fine. That actually makes perfect sense. Perfect sense. Okay. You get to... Ah, uh, yes. You bridge. You floodgate. No, not that one. This one. There. That is as it should be. Okay. Screw pump. Pump from east. Use glass blocks, gra glass, glass. There. That should be good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So the mechanics should be making all the things when they have a moment. Which is perfect. So this will let the magma into there, which is fine. And we'll be able to use it to flood it down here. And we'll be able to actually change the size of the reservoir. Like, we're gonna be conservative. Actually, should we be conservative first time around? I don't see why we should be. Like, I would want to test this to see if there's a backwash, right? So... Well... I suppose... Well, this thing... At first it's gonna spread out just... Through the lower levels, right? Wait, what? He has become enraged. Shit! Okay, I think he stopped. I think it's fine. Okay. So this is closed off. And this is gonna be 
How about you do it now, okay? How you make it a priority to hook that one up, okay? Just like whatever, just get it done, because I want this floodgate open so we can travel through here. For now. And I really want to see what it looks like when we magmar this fucking thing. Because that's like a tactical nuke option, right? And I like nukes. Oh, look. A uh, furniture stockpile has... Cyril has become a... Huh. Cyril has grown up to become a peasant. Well, what do we need from the peasantry? Uh huh. Well, that's actually a good question. Why don't we go with butchery tannery? Because I'm not sure that we have enough people on that. We do. Okay. What else can we put you on then? Yeah, that's the thing. If we have gonna have a lot of potash making, that's gonna get awkward. We could put you on furnace operating. We currently have what six? No, we have five. So, I'd say that we should top out furnace working at 6, so that gives you exactly one spot. So, congratulations, you can furnace now. Okay, has that been done? It has, excellent. Pull it open. Okay, this needs masonry to finish now. And this is just them trying to mechanic it up. Reasonable, reasonable. Uh, windmill. Actually, no, not yet, not yet. Not until it's done and I have actually disengaged the pumping. Till, you know, it's safe. Actually, if it remains the way it is currently, we're gonna get back spillage. We need to finish setting it up properly first. But that's fine. We'll we'll uh, see it happen. Seems like reasonable sized reservoir as well. Like it's a question of how good a trap this is, because in a way it needs to wait until the beasties are in the gate. Which is Something we can manage. We can just kill them as they are coming in through the main stairway, through the gate, if they get past the traps. Any survivors, right? And the rest we can wash away. It's just a question of catching the right moment. It would really be a matter of getting the civilians to hide in the lever room. And what did you claim? What did you claim? Not mechanics. Certainly. Okay, this one. Okay, fair enough. Have fun with that then, I suppose. We probably want to remove all the quivers and the like from here for when we nuke things with magma. Probably. Cut greed glass. Crap. It's the wrong body job. Wrong. Make raw green glass. 200. Jesus. Go and make some. That's what I want. Okay. So we'll be able to close off this. Well and good. I just want to see what happens when we blast this with magma. I, I really want to try it. And actually, I can always just... Actually, I can wall this off with Kimberlite, can't I? And just put a... freaking... iron door there. Surely I have enough iron for one more. 
Can you make me one? We'll try. That'll probably be safer, because iron does not melt in magma. So, let's just make a completely safe thing here. I could actually um, connect it to this. Make it even safer. But I've already ordered an iron door, so... We're not gonna... Have you made it? Doesn't look like he had enough uh, iron, actually. Unfortunately, so yeah, we're gonna have to dig in like this. Sadness, sadness ensues. In fact, dig out all of this fugliness as well. Gonna rearrange things slightly here. Just a wall right here. Okay, they should work fine. Kimberlite here. Glorious blocks here as well. And here. And here. Uh, actually, here as well. There we go. Right, and you are milling dimple cups of all things. Freaking dimple cups. I can't even complain. Just do what you need to do. Actually, I could make a permanent... Um, for permanent work order. For perpetual stuff. And remove this workshop plugin entirely. Excuse me, someone's at my door. Alright. Okay, looks like I'm gonna have to take a quick break in a second. But let's just finish this here thing up. Oh, did I fuck this up? I did. Excellent. Rip up these two tiles. Thank you. Also, I'm gonna want this part smooth, so, you know, when you have a moment smoothers. I know they're completely overloaded, that's okay. They'll catch up at some point. Just gonna make milk plants a permanent order so that I never have to worry about it. It's gonna be great. Did you suspend that wall? You did, didn't you? Well, the dwarf that was in the way is no longer in the way. So, that is most excellent. Okay. And we're nearly at the end of the episode anyway. No, seriously, if you could, like, stop being a fucked out, that would be great, okay? Okay, good. So this is gonna be essentially a permanent mill plants. And that is actually really good. So this has been dug. Okay. Where are my gold bars? We're gonna order a couple of kitchens and a couple of stills, enough to provide for the needs of the entire fortress. Here we go. Just set up production for the good of the fortress. Yeah, now that I'm thinking about it, we won't have room for soaping downstairs, will we? Because we're gonna have butchers, tanners, probably a... Yeah, we'll have to put that upstairs in the room that's been, you know, freed up. 
So now you're going to be rendering fat, which is perfect. Okay, now. Why don't we make an ashery here? And a soapers here. Maybe not out of basalt though. How about we make it out of actual gold? Okay. And downstairs. We're gonna have a corpse pile as well, by the way, but for now. Uh, butchers. Let's just make sure that everything is set up to spec. Now, if we ever decide to milk a animal or something, we might want this here. And we want a fishery because eventually we'll probably going to be doing some fishing downstairs because I've grown to like fishing, you know. Are you like badly fucked up? No, you're just slightly scarred. And let me just Oh, right, I've never changed that shit. There, at a thousand. This is now a magma, uh, mega food stockpile. For reasons. Uh, we don't keep seeds here. And we don't keep... Oh, God damn it. Shit brain, shit, pigtails. They were called pigtails. Upstairs, we only keep seeds. There. And this will allow us to turn all our great and milled plants into useful things. Like actual meals, you know, flour, the like, sugar. All of it will help become meals. See? Flour. We have it. It is there. It might be glorious one day, with a bit of luck. And just before we wrap up this part... Well, uh, we can make our Captain of the Guard very happy. By giving him a bunch of cool stuff. Right? Right, because we are awesome like that. Gold chests, there we go. Right, we have two cloth ears. And yarn bags, we made yarn bags. Cloth. Cloth bag. There. Cloth. Cloth bag. Cloth rope. And... Okay, we have one cloth here, but I think we need a second one. In order to justify the two slots that we have. There we go. Now we're gonna... This will essentially supply us with all the bags we need. And that will make it perfect. Come on, come on, come on, I just want to define this final bit with the noble. And I'm gonna have to actually look through the ordinary coffins to make sure that named characters weren't... weren't buried as ordinary peasants, because that is unacceptable. We could actually set up a magma thing on this level, because we have the iron door, we could just... That would make it... That would take it longer to dry out, wouldn't it? I mean, as is, it's gonna take longer to dry out anyway. Maybe we should have an emergency exit somewhere, with a second bridge that we can open. For, you know, when things go horrible. Let's actually make it... No. 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 Bad. That will 
Go to the Baron. You do not get to have that one. So, Captain of the Guard. Dining room. Captain of the Guard. And a chair. If someone could bring it would be great. No, really, I need a chair there. Speaking of, could use some doors here to make it look nicer. How are we proceeding on the beds, by the way? Okay, nicely. Sweet. Okay. Come on. And throne room or study. Captain of the guard. Now, if you tell me that you have a problem still, you don't. You actually don't. Uh, well, you are. And you know, you have gotten a lot better at setting bones and, in particular, dressing wounds. You have vastly improved. You got a lot of practice. We had a tiny bit of a weird creature spiral. But I'm gonna end this part here and I will be back in a couple of minutes.